To log in to the Reading Horizons Elevate Administration Portal as an account administrator, click the Administrator Login in the top right-hand corner of the screen. Enter your username and password and press Login. The Sites tab is selected by default each time you enter the Administration Portal. There are different levels of account access, so if you do not see a Sites tab, we recommend you watch the Reading Horizons Elevate Site Administrator tutorial, which will match the settings associated with your account. The Sites tab shows a list of all the sites associated with your account, the number of entries, and the number of students associated with each account. In this view, account administrators can add new sites, edit or delete existing sites, as well as manage individual sites. To add a new site, click on Add Site and provide the requested information. If you are unable to add a new site, you may have used all the sites available to your account. To add more sites, contact your Reading Horizons account representative. To edit, delete, or manage a site, select the desired site from the site list and then click on the desired function. First, let's review how to edit a site. Here we see the details for the selected site. Notice that only the site name and site login are required under the Site Information section. The site name should identify the specific location at which the software will be used. The site login must be entered by the students or users as part of the login process, so it is recommended that you choose a site login that is easy to remember and that is not too lengthy. You should also know that no spaces are allowed. If the site login is already taken, you will be prompted to enter a different site login. When editing a site, you can also manage the seat allocations as well as the language packages you have purchased. When you are finished editing, press the Save Site button. Next, let's review how to manage a site. This will show the site level administration portal for the chosen site. This is where you should go to add or edit users, to associate administrators with users or groups, to view user and class reports, to adjust other settings, and to see more details relating to a specific site. To learn more about managing sites, watch the Reading Horizons Elevate Site Administrator tutorial. To change the site being viewed, select another site from the expanding list in the bottom left-hand corner. To go back to the overall account view, select Back to Account. To manage the administrators associated with the account and each site, select the Administrators tab. Here you are shown a list of all the current administrators, their email addresses, and the administration title they have been assigned. An account administrator has access to all aspects of the account – sites, administrators, and users. There should only be two or three active account administrators at any given time to avoid duplication of efforts and or conflicting activities. Site administrators have access to the site or school which they are assigned, as well as all instructors and students within that site. Instructors have access to the site or school to which they are assigned, but can only edit the students assigned to them. To add an administrator, click on Add Administrator. Provide all the requested information, select the desired administrator role, and add all the sites to which this administrator will be assigned. To assign sites to an administrator, Either drag or drop them from the list of available sites on the right to the list of selected sites on the left, or select the desired sites and then click the double arrow button. Click Save Administrator when you are finished. You will need to communicate the username and password to any new administrators before they can access the portal. To learn more about the Reports and Advanced tabs, Please watch the Reading Horizons Elevate Site Administrator tutorial. To log out from the Administration Portal, click Logout in the upper right-hand corner.